-hmm. And just to be clear, when the rain comes out, you mm -hmm. acidify, you can acidify regions that could be harmful to wildlife mm -hmm. or plant life. So again, um, in this, uh, as opposed to when we do it through pollution, these aerosols would mix very well. And most of that actually would fall, most of the aerosols then would fall over the oceans, where really sulfate is not something that affects ocean acidification that much because that's mostly carbon driven. Again, that's a clear trade-off. You would increase pollution by a little bit. Yes, that's one of the, again, the, that's one of the things we definitely are looking into and should be looking into more, actually quantifying and understanding these trade-offs, all the things that could go wrong. And it could very well be that there are other things that could go wrong that we don't know yet, or maybe we haven't thought about, because there, if suddenly we found, we found a roadblock, something we hadn't thought about, nobody had thought about in the last 30 years that would make these, no, look, we really can't do this. Here's the reason why we can't do that. So 